We have an update tonight on the crisis in Syria. The Good civil evening. war that More has killed over 20,000 people are now thought to have been killed in southern Asia after an unforeseen earthquake. Hurricanes, earthquakes, floods, drought, volcanoes, famine, war. To us, USAID's Office of U.S. Foreign Disaster Assistance, or OFTA, these disasters are more than heart-wrenching news stories. They're families driven from their homes, needing shelter, clean water, and emergency nutrition. They're infants and children in need of medical care and vaccines. Their families displaced or torn apart, and they are lives lost if help does not reach them in time. America has a long and distinguished history of helping those most in need. Since 1964, OFTA, as part of USAID, has embodied America's compassion at the forefront of the U.S. government's humanitarian response immediately after disasters strike and conflicts erupt around the world. No matter where, no matter when, we and our partners are there to help, to give hope. USAID's OFTA responds to an average of 70 disasters in more than 50 countries every year. And every year, our experts work strategically with international responders and other donor governments to help tens of millions of people and save countless lives. We and our partners are crisis response experts, logisticians, and engineers. We are scientists, infectious disease specialists, doctors and nutritionists. We are agriculture and livestock experts. We are elite search and rescue teams. We come from every walk of life and live all over the world, but we all have one thing in common. We are all professional humanitarians. Making life better for those in need, proud to represent America even in the most difficult and dangerous circumstances. As part of USAID, OFTA acts on behalf of the American people around the world to provide emergency shelter and clean water to families who have lost their homes, give medical care to thousands of displaced families, provide life-saving nutrition to malnourished children, give people tools to get back to work and help jumpstart their local economy. But as the coordinator of the U.S. government's international relief efforts, we do even more. Like save tens of thousands of lives by helping people get out of harm's way, thanks in part to early warning systems we developed with our partners. Train people to be first responders and advise them how to build earthquake-resistant homes. These preparedness efforts save lives and reduce the economic impact of future disasters. OFTA also helps to build resilience in communities, providing people with the tools and knowledge necessary to rebound quickly and ultimately build a brighter future. Less than 1% of America's federal budget is allocated for foreign assistance. And OFTA's budget is a mere 1% of that. We know we have a responsibility to the American people to use our budget wisely. So we strive to make the most of our resources by listening to those in need and strategically locating our people and relief supplies around the world. We also have the ability to call other U.S. government agencies into action at a moment's notice, whenever they are needed. And we tap into a vast international network of humanitarian partners through our funding and engagement with U.N. agencies, non-governmental organizations, local relief groups, and others. We are fast. We are efficient. We are flexible and we are effective. Our mission is to save lives, alleviate human suffering, 
and reduce the economic and social impact of disasters. It's not only our mandate, it's our calling. We are OFTA, and we are proud to help carry out America's humanitarian efforts around the world. <laughs>